Hey, YouTube, Scott Stevens here. Welcome to another edition of WWE 2K22. My requests. We're going to continue down the list here with another NWA World Championship match. This list was sent in by Wrestling Freak 79. This is Kerry Von Erich challenging Ric Flair for his NWA World Heavyweight Champion. It takes place at um, WCW Saturday Night's Arena, and it's the match will be held inside the Scrap Trap Cage. So this one should have some pretty cool visuals to it. If you have a match that you'd like to see, just leave it in the comments down below. Tell me the participants, the type of match you'd like to see them in, and, of course, the arena. If you want to leave uh, random things, that's fine, too. Males, females, current day stars, legends, whatever you want to see. Uh, do my best to play them out. They're a lot of fun. And uh, if you have something that's a little bit obscure, it helps me if you can check out the community and see if someone else has done it. Um, and let me know the creator's name. That will speed up a lot. That way I can do a lot more matches. But let's get to this one. Remember, guys, the title is on the line here in this one. And I don't remember the last time the champ was in this much jeopardy, Cole. Tonight might just be the night the title changes hands. Oh, it could. Kerry Von Erich is no slouch. This title match already trending on social media. The challenger knows he has a good chance of becoming champion tonight. This is the first time I've seen this arena. It looks pretty cool. Is there anyone greater? Nate is here. <laughs> There's only one. I've got serious goosebumps right now. As well you should, Saxton. You are staring at the best to ever lace up the boots. We are in the presence of true greatness. The dirtiest player in the game. The epitome of an all-time great. Never looked better. Introducing the challenger from Denton, Texas, weighing in at 275 pounds, Kerry the Eric. And introducing the champion from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 245 pounds, he is the non-stop wrestling alliance. World's Heavyweight Champion, The Nature Boy, Rick Flair! Highly anticipated. 
anticipated championship match set to begin. Why is that showing upside down on the sign over there? I noticed that when it first started, too. Big hip toss by Kerry Von Erich. Alright, he's going off the top rope, dropping a big leg across Ric Flair's throat. He got a lot of height on that one. And he's going to try and climb the wall right away. Stupid. This is a cool cage. Yeah, Ric Flair does one move, and then he's going to try and get out. I'm not going to do more than one fall here if this continues. That's just fucking stupid that the AI is so bad. It makes you wonder if 2K played any of these matches out to see what would happen. And he takes a bunch of chops and punches and then turns it around to his favor and drops a DDT on Kerry Von Erich. Do something, Kerry. Rick Flair eats some steel bars. Falls back down to the canvas, but Kerry's not going to get up. Flair gets right back up. And returns the favor. And now he's going up top. <laughs> Rick Flair down to the canvas hard after eating some more steel bars. Now Kerry Von Erich working his way to the top of the cage. He's got some time. No, not really. And he just couldn't get that second leg over. Once again, Flair's head slams into the steel bars a second time. He's back down to the canvas again. Harry Von Erich once again climbing toward the top of the cage. He's got plenty of time. If he wants to throw that leg over, he can. Oh, 
floor even more. And victory looking more and more likely for him now in this steel cage match. All he has to do is drop down to the floor and his hand will be raised. Looking for a grip to get themselves over the cage. Rick Blair, that's like the fifth time his head slammed into the steel rods of this cage. That time he blocks it and knocks Kerry back down to the canvas. Blair continuing his climb up top, but Kerry Von Erich got up pretty quick. He's going to put a stop to that. Now Blair comes down. It's all it is is just to knock him down, climb to the top, knock him down, climb to the top. The AI in steel cage matches is just brutal seen enough of them now to know it. They're, they're just terrible. He's looking down on the cage to the top. And as he continues to climb the side of the cage, you have to think his confidence is starting to build. He doesn't want to spend too much time up there. And Ric Flair hits the canvas. Kerry Von Erich will should easily get that second leg over. I mean, come on now. That's a little ridiculous. Flair down to the canvas again. Carey continues his climb. Once again, he's got plenty of time to get that second leg over. And once again, he does not do it. Yeah, he's having a lot of trouble. The lack of resistance. Flair's back down to the canvas, and that could be it. And there it is. Kerry Von Erich gets the leg over. He is your new NWA World Heavyweight Champion. Flair drops the title in another shitty cage match. One and a half stars, lackluster. I have to agree with it. All the cage matches are shit, it seems. All right, so Kerry Von Erich wins the NWA World Heavyweight Championship from Ric Flair in the Scrap Trap steel cage. That's a cool thing to see there. Um, once again, the cage match sucked. They all seem to suck. The AI just does not perform well in the cage matches. Uh, that's the last NWA title match I'm going to do today. That was sent in by Wrestling Freak 79. Still have three more matches left on his list. I'll do them uh, tomorrow or the next day. I will do one more live stream, though. Um, I have a bunch that were sent in from uh, Ryan Smith, and I didn't get to any of his today. So I'm going to do one of his next in just a few minutes, and that will be my last live stream of the day. If you have a match that you'd like to see, go ahead and leave it down below in the comments. Your uh, participants, the type of match, and the arena, and I will do what I can to play it out for you on here. I thank you for joining me. If you liked that shitty match, make sure you please drop a like down below, give it a thumbs up, turn on your notifications so you know when I have new content going up. I do a minimum of two videos each and every single day. Most of the time it's more than that. And I would appreciate it if you would... Subscribe to the channel. I have a ton of uh, stuff coming up. My GM stuff scheduled to post. My Rise stuff scheduled to post. And I, like I said, I revamped my universe. So I'll be starting that again um, very soon. So uh, also I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. If I, if I can get to that point, um, I want to do some really cool stuff that uh, obviously you're a wrestling fan. Um, you'll, you'll like what I have planned, but I got to get there first. So I need your help. I would appreciate it. 
Um, I will do one more live stream in just a few more minutes. If I see you there, that's cool. I'll see you then. If not, then have a fantastic day.